Hi folks, uh, this is my uh, 1981 Rolls Royce Silver Spirit and uh, very frustrating it is that uh, I can't drive it. I actually haven't driven it yet and it's been sitting here for the last month because we're in uh, COVID lockdown and uh, that's pretty bloody boring and, and the car is in good condition. Uh, paint job, upholstery and everything. But today I'm uh, going to change the gearbox on the driver's seat. Uh, it was broken, that was one of the things wrong with the car when I bought it. And uh, <laughs> and the other thing is uh, the exhaust system, and I can't fix the exhaust system because we're in lockdown. And uh, very frustrating. So I'll have to wait until they let us free and once I get the exhaust system done, I can uh, get a blue slip for the car. So here we go with the uh, driver's seat gearbox. It's a funny thing, I thought the uh, second-hand gearbox I bought uh, might take a bit longer to come in. So this morning, I uh, took the uh, seat out and uh, disconnected the old one. And I'll, I'll just show you how to pull the seat out. You just... Uh, Pick it, pull the lever here and kick the back back and you put your hand in there and you just pull out the seat so I'm going to kick it back and pull the seat out now on the bottom of the street seat there's a strap which uh, connects somewhere this one's broken there's the other piece uh, I don't know why <laughs> because <laughs> uh, in case you lose a seat, I suppose. <laughs> right, so this is my old uh, gearbox here, the motor there, and uh, to get there's uh, three electrical plugs. There's one here, uh, one over here, and one that goes up to the motor over there. Just unplug them, and uh, the only thing that holds the motor in place is this clamp and one screw hooks onto a bracket the rest of the thing just sits on the floor now what I did this morning I took this one out and you can see the uh, drive cables there and because uh, I wanted to get in the position that I could drive the car so I got a battery drill put it on the ends of the cables and ran the street uh, seat in position and also I wanted to test if any of the little uh, gear drives were jammed there's a gear drive there there's a little gear drive there they weren't jammed but what had happened the seats all the way back as far as I could run and down as far as I could go so whoever owned this car was huge <laughs> and uh, <laughs> and I wanted to make sure that, uh, like I said before, that everything wasn't jammed. And what I reckon's happened, the guys run it right back and kept persisting on trying to push it back forward or, uh, or down more. And these gearboxes are only made of plastic. And uh, I'll show you. See the big chunk out of my gearbox there? Uh, and you think, Rolls-Royce would have made these out of cast or something but I've been told apparently they come out of a Cadillac or something like that so what I'm going to do is take the motor off the, the old gearbox and put it on my new second-hand gearbox I don't even know if you can buy these anymore uh, but anyway so I shall do that and we'll take it from there just a little a uh, 7mm socket to undo these nuts here. On the end of the uh, motor is a little coupling and uh, in the gearbox, and this one's from my smash gearbox, you can see it uh, shaft lines up into the coupling. So I'll just put that in that and screw it on. Right here, I've got all my uh, shafts or winding shafts connected and uh, what I've got to do now is put the bolt and the clamp over there 
clamps a motor down and that's the bolt and it's a 4.5 millimeter allen head so uh, I'll just struggle with that um, when you you have to muck around a little bit to line up the shafts on these to get them in but anyway I'll just bolt the motor down and then we'll try it out well everything is a learning curve um, I plug the plugs in and everything and the uh, book uh, says run it all the way forward till it stops to make sure these uh, this one and the one under here uh, little gearboxes for running the seat in and out are lined up and even I did that and it didn't work <laughs> so I ran it all the way back I thought okay I'll try it at the back end so I ran it all the way back and it, uh, they line up and now they work um, that's uh, forward reverse and the other one's up and up and down whatever it is there so there we go we've uh, got our second hand gearbox working the good news about this uh, I don't move the seat much or, or anything uh, when I'm driving so that should be all right uh, should last another 10 years or more I have okay that's it for our 1981 Rolls-Royce Silver Spirit I'll catch you later